Nice weather tonight. Still staying warm into tomorrow, hopefully. Yeah, 40s this weekend. So Sounds really good. Not bad. And it was gorgeous today. We have mm -hmm. weather watchers that call and give us temperatures. And little Lily Johnson in Norfolk, Nebraska, meteorologist in training, called me today and said it was a top 10 day for winter. And I just want to tell you, girl, I agree. Top 10 day it was. 42 degrees, she said it was in Norfolk, Nebraska. 42 also in Neely. Uh, some upper 30s for most of us, 39 in Sioux City and 38 in Cherokee, but really, really was a top 10 day for January. And we're ending with a gorgeous sunset. Just look how beautiful this looks on the Portney Multi Company Sky Cam HD. Just can't get any better than that melting snow, sunshine, and real beauty uh, to end the day. 39 are high in Sioux City. Our morning low is pretty warm as well. 34 uh, this morning. Again, both above normal, and we'll stay with the above normal trend for at least the next two, three days. Some clouds rolling in in Sioux City, 34 degrees. And here are some of those current temperatures still in the mid 30s, 34 Sioux City. Some cooler 20s in northern Iowa, 26 in Spencer, but still some 40s in Nebraska, and then some of those upper 20s there. Winds uh, kind of calm and kind of shifting a little bit. We'll start to see more of a southerly flow take presence tonight and tomorrow. Winds will be calm tonight, which will help uh, the, with the development of some patchy fog. Probably cloudy tonight and not too cold. Again, some of that patchy fog in a chilly morning in the mid-20s, but that's still above where we should be for a January morning. So here's the kind of breaks in the clouds that we saw today. Sioux City saw mostly sunshine, but for areas uh, towards the Iowa border, there was some more cloud cover there, and we'll probably probably see something similar to that for tomorrow. A low pressure up uh, towards the Great Lakes is what's bringing us some of those clouds, and we'll have another system kind of clip from the top tomorrow, which will also bring a few more clouds to us, but no real precipitation is really expected. So pretty calm tonight, clouds and some patchy fog, pretty quiet. Tomorrow, we'll have that south wind take precedent, and it will really bring those temperatures up even more than they were today. Mid-40s should feel real great tomorrow. And you can see here's that little clipper system that's going to pass. We'll stay dry, but maybe some more clouds, especially in northwest Iowa over there. But otherwise, sun and clouds, maybe more clouds than sun, but you can't complain tomorrow either. Calm tomorrow night as well. Uh, just some clouds and not too bad there. Then as we uh, head towards uh, Saturday, we'll keep that south wind in place. Warmer temperatures Saturday as well. And then Saturday night, we could bring in a chance for a wintry mix, maybe some rain, snow together late Saturday, kind of more Sunday morning. But it's out of here fast, very light accumulations with that. So tonight, 24 degrees, patchy fog, and a little bit chilly with those calm winds. Tomorrow, 45, a pleasant Friday, sun and clouds. Again, maybe some more clouds. But I mean, 45 degrees, who is going to complain? More clouds for Saturday with 46 degrees, a mix uh, for the morning on Sunday and then uh, we take a break with the kind of wintry mix for Monday and then all eyes on Tuesday. So what could we, we could tell you that we know so far, it's looking like snow is pretty likely, 60% chance that's likely, especially five days out. Winds even more likely than that, pretty blustery uh, with gusts to 40. Some possible threats we're looking at, heavy snow, blowing, drifting snow, high winds and low visibility and uh, we're keeping an eye on the storm track. Could be through Sioux City, could be farther south and east. So once we get that down, then we can bring some totals to you. Lots more info to come exactly. as we get into the weekend. Thanks, Elisa. Yeah.